Welcome to Garrity RV Center in famous Junction City, Oregon. My name is Brian Koch and I want to take the opportunity to share with you a brand new floor plan from Winnebago called the 32YE. I think you're going to find that it's going to afford more than your family needs as far as storage capacity on the outside and livability and plenty of storage on the inside. It of course has the gas powered Triton V10 which has been used really through the RV industry for decades. Um, super reliable, super easy to care for and uh, goodness gracious it's Ford, can't go wrong. Outside here I want to show you something that will make your game day even more fun. Certainly an opportunity for you to enjoy a rainy day with that power awning if the kids want to be able to watch some movies and things but still keep them outside. Outdoor entertainment has become a very popular amenity in today's coaches. Tell you where Winnebago really made a huge improvement. Oftentimes you don't find this kind of storage until you move into a diesel pusher. And this is actually pass through storage, as you can see, accessible from both sides of the coach. So whether it's your big rubber raft, whether it's your folding tables, whether you enjoy fishing, you've got more than enough space to be able to store your longer items and enjoy your time away from home with the family. I'm going to come around the other side, but as you can see, we've got a slide out in the bedroom. We've got a huge slide on the other side, and I can't wait to show you inside what that's going to do for your family and the space you'll have. So here on the driver's side, we've got the wet bay location. Super jealous of this. My older coach looks nothing like this and is very hard to access. They've done a great job again. The beauties of having a modern coach. We only have a 30 amp supply because we've only got one air conditioner, but it's fully ducted on the inside. That generator is going to be located right there in the rear quarter panel but here in the wet bay everything accessible we've got cabinet lighting if for any reason you show up at that campsite late at night but everything very easy to reach and especially that sewer hose which can be very very complicated um, in a lot of coaches including mine it's very very easy to deal with that job we all have to deal with again we've got the storage cabinets along the side and your propane tank no need to open those up because you saw they pass through both ways on either side let me show you the inside of the coach and I think you're going to be very impressed so here we are now in the main living area of the 32YE. Once again, a brand new floor plan from Winnebago, and that's one of their secrets. They're able to do some floor plans that other manufacturers just can't do because they custom build about 80% of all their parts and pieces. Here we actually have a great storage area underneath the couch, which is also um, a jackknife sofa. So super easy to make a bed if you need some sleeping arrangements. And I'll tell you the big complaint I get from a lot of people on the pre-owned is where in the world are my cup holders, especially when I'm sitting on the couch. <clears throat> and you actually have the cup holders there. You've got cup holders up front. You have cup holders here in the dinette area. Funny little thing that they just weren't doing in a lot of coaches for a long time. Upper cabinet storage, more than deep enough to carry full-size plates and the things you need for enjoying a meal with the family. As we roll around here into the kitchen again, expansive storage area. You're not going to be short on pot and pan storage, and they've done a really, really good job actually for a couple of options underneath the sink for wastebasket storage. Nice wood cabinetry, again, Winnebago finish work. We've got a cathedral ceiling here, which just opens up the space and makes it feel more open. Again, one of the beauties of a Class A. Traditional oven, and then a traditional microwave. And again, as I mentioned, a lot of storage, four door refrigerator. I'll tell you one of the things I love about a new coach is the smell of a new refrigerator instead of a pre-owned coach refrigerator. Okay, it actually smells new and clean. I like that. We've got pantry storage over here. Very deep, cereal boxes, cans of SpaghettiOs, whatever you're into, you're gonna be able to bring plenty. I think I said bring plenty. We've got our main uh, control center right here midship, which is very easy. And this little dangling key I'm gonna show you is actually a full-size power bunk up front. Again, sleeping area in a pinch, super easy. It's going to be difficult for you to come around the area. I'll let you come on the other side here, but we've got a nice skylight, lots of light. We really only have this LED light right here, <clears throat> and you'll notice how light and bright the shower is as we come around the corner and show you the restroom. So as we come this way, medicine cabinet storage, a little bit of a smaller vanity sink, but again, when you look at all of the supplies that we like to bring with us, especially on a long trip, more than ample storage. My big impressed thing, again, good job Winnebago. Storage, 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 it's what everybody wants. And if you're any taller than I am, you're gonna really appreciate the shower. It truly is a usable shower. I'm six foot tall and you could easily be six foot four, six foot five and get in there. And those of you who are a little bit larger are also gonna appreciate the fact that on this coach, a king size bed. And not only is it king size, but it is a true 
walk around bed. And we've got uh, end table storage. And then we also have outlets for anybody who needs to charge their cell phones, which I think is everybody. Or if you have a CPAP machine, we've got those uh, accessible locations for you. Last piece that everybody asks for, wardrobe storage. And this is one of the biggest wardrobe cabinets I've ever seen in a gas Class A coach. Hanging items are really important, especially here in the Northwest where you have to be prepared for any kind of weather. And as we roll through the front of the coach, super easy. The key was back there for safety, so if you do have kids that can't mess with the power bunk, this has three features that it can be used for. Number one, the bed can be made up all the time, and all you do is push the button. This will power down. You've got a little ladder, and you've got your sleeping area without having to make up the couch or the dinette in the living area. Number two, it's a great storage area if you just bring it down part way once you're established. You can put your coach, your leashes, those kinds of things. And the last thing that it is is really a safe. If you've got valuables and you're taking that hike, you can raise this up, lock it into place, remove the key, and nobody can get to your stuff. I like that. So here we are in the front. Both of these chairs are going to swivel. We've got a workstation. You can be using that as an eating area. We also have a removable dining table that comes right here. So if you've got the beautiful view out front, you're going to be able to access this part of the coach and enjoy your view. Power leveling system as expected. And they've tilted this navigation uh, video screen um, with the rear view camera and your stereo so you can actually view it as the driver. Again, my name is Brian Koch. I appreciate you watching. I hope you contact me directly at the number that you see there at the bottom of the screen or directly on my cell phone at 541-912-7277. Love to show you the coach in person and take it for a drive. And maybe I'll see you on the road.